it's been an entire year since I've been out of the country. It's amazing, honestly, to be back in a place like this, as gorgeous as it is, as pristine as it is, and to see how much has changed in all that time. It feels like a big relief to be back, even though the world still isn't quite right. But we're back to do some diving. We're back to enjoy this lovely luxury villa with a garden. And even Glenn's with us. Good morning, Glenn. Good morning. Are you going diving today? Today? Today is it. Today's the day. Today, we're going to Angelita, which is one of my all-time favorite dives. We're going to Car Wash, which is always a great time. Still getting ourselves acclimated a little bit. And then we're going to go check out what's changed around here. But we're prepared, to say the least. At least I can tell you. We got a nice place to stay, so we're going to have a good time and looking forward to sharing it with you. So let's get it. Tulum in the morning is very different than Tulum in the afternoon. Here you get to relax. By the afternoon, this place is going to be crawling, but you make it out early. You don't got to worry about much. Anyway, we're here at the dive shop. We're getting ready to go. Glenn's ready to go. Kooks. Kooks are the best here in town. They got the whole thing going on. Organized, good guides, education, and if you're just out there because you're an experienced diver and you want to dive with someone who knows where they're going, they put you on really well. All right, we just arrived to Angelita, one of the most peaceful, beautiful dives in this entire area. We're gonna walk down and check out the cenote before we get in here. We couldn't have asked for better weather. It's like our own little Mayan village down here. Half a cave system, okay. like a passages and tunnel. Okay. It goes straight down.
is my man Cyril. Say what's up, Cyril. What up? Just he's getting a, ready for a uh, Cenote dive. That's right. This is a Utila alum like me. We're out here representing the best of the island. And today we're at Car Wash, yeah. also known as Octoon Ha. Is the water down there sick or what? It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Let's go yeah. take a look at this stuff, man. I have to ask me again after the dive. Yeah, we're going to get a better but. sense of it in a minute. But this is a real deal Cenote experience. Well, it's amazing. Look at that water. How you doing? Oh, Welcome good. to Car Wash. Oh, nice. We're ready for it. Time to gear up. This is a really fun cenote dive. The water is beautiful. The color gradations in the cavern are absolutely spectacular. And Glenn is ready. Ready to rock and roll here. Let's go do it. We got Don Victor over here. He's ready. We got Peter. Yeah. Who lost his phone already. Already. Earlier trip. And Cyril's ready to rock too. So I'm ready to jump in. Let's go have some fun. excited to be at one of my favorite places in the entire world there's a lot you can do in diving but very few diving experiences are as majestic as this we are at a place called Dreamgate which I think is one of the best cenote dives in all of Tulum it is the quintessential experience of exploration look at this place hidden in the jungle, you'd never know it was there. And to get down and really experience it, let's check this out. We are the only ones here today. Timeless. Look how clear the water is. You can kind of see that it goes down and under.
This is Dreamgate. This is one of the most pristine cenotes in all of Tulum. And to be here as the only team going in, the first team going in on a Friday, you really can't do better than that. What do you guys think about this? Stunning. Stunning. Amazing. Words can't describe it. Yes. Have you ever I mean, seen a place like have you ever seen a place like this before? Never seen anything like this before. We're standing in the middle of a jungle, ready to do an unbelievable dive. <laughs> Incredible. I mean, to think that this actually exists in nature and we get the we have the ability and we have the, the luxury and the in the yeah. privilege of it's being an able to privilege. dive this. Yeah. I mean, this is just this is what it's about. This is why we do what we do. I couldn't say it any better. This is what it's about. So we're gonna get our gear together. We're gonna to get the camera set up. Today we're actually gonna do a photo shoot. So we're gonna do an exploration dive to really get a sense of it. And then we're gonna come back again and set up the cameras, set up the lights, and see if we can do some really spectacular photography. I have to What is that? Battery light? Wow. The all important crotch strap. So, How about you, Peter? You getting ready? I'm nearly ready. Gear looks good. Gauge looks good. It's a little windy, but we're going to try this anyway. Another successful journey here in Tulum, Mexico. One of the most beautiful beaches in the world, probably the best cenote diving in the world. And well, I don't really want to leave, but I guess that's how it goes when you find yourself in paradise. You can't stay forever, otherwise you're not going to appreciate it. Or maybe you can stay forever. I don't know. If I was going to stay somewhere and I was going to take in the sights and sounds and make it home, hard to beat a place like this. So, hope you enjoyed it. And uh, when the world opens up, I guess we'll see you here. <laughs>